Hello, this. Good morning, beautiful world. Good evening, good afternoon, everywhere, wherever you are, whatever the time. Disease or dis dysfunction? Why, why, why? We believe that there's nothing called this ideology implantation from our brain where we believe that disease exists. There's nothing called disease. It's a dysfunction. Your body goes through a temporary dysfunction. It's crying. It's crying, telling you something is wrong, something is missing for me to fix itself, myself by myself. I have the capability, I have the ability to fix myself. That's based on the American Association of Osteopathy. The body is based on the tenets. One of the tenets is that the body is its own innate ability to self-healing, self-protection, self-maintenance. So if the body fits itself, the body is crying. It's, you are not sick. Like Dr. Bert Mengelij, he said, you are not sick. You are thirst. Do not treat thirst with medication. So you are really, your body is crying. Your body is sending you a message. And if you do not respond to the root cause of that complications, then it gets worse and worse and worse. What's happening when you take your medication is just what? It's just, it's just, just solving the, only the symptom. You're not solving the root cause. You're not listening to the plea of your body. Let's go here. <laughs> Let's go to the definition of, uh, part of the definition of a disease. The National Center for Biotechnology Information of the National Library of Medicine of the United States, it says that medical definitions of the disease state are lacking, lacking or insufficient. They are lacking or insufficient. So what does it mean? Why it's insufficient? Because there's too much controversy about how to treat a so-called disease. So we need to change, we need to remove, we need to erase something called disease. You do not have disease. You don't have asthma, you don't have a, a lumbago, you don't have a cancer, you don't have whatever you call it. We're giving credit by thinking that the human body is gonna fix you, but it's your body gonna fix itself by itself. But you need to understand, understand what your body is crying, what your body is craving for. Okay, so for this reason, we came up with our own hypothesis, our own definition. We coined our own definition. We want to remove something called disease. So it's a dysfunction. Now, what is that? A healthy deterioration. A healthy deterioration is not a disease. It's a dysfunction in the body's functions resulted from a lack or depletion of essential fuels in the body, which impairs the body's innate ability to self-healing, self-protection, and self-regulation, self-maintenance. This is so simple. Well, why? <laughs> Let's see the human fuels. Let's see the difference between you and a human's made machine. A human-made machine, irrespective of its what, the, a vehicle, a ship, a cruise, an aeroplane, whatever, anything that's created by human, let's call it a machine. For example, a vehicle. It relies on a human's regular maintenance, number one. It re relies on human's so-called fuels. So for example, a vehicle, it relies on specific fuels. These fuels are particularly, specifically, in the, for example, engine oil coolant, engine oil, power steering fluid, brake oil, brake fluid, and transmission oil. Irrespective of the brand of the vehicle, the model. If you do not make sure you maintain these fuels, you will not run that vehicle. It's a Lamborghini, it's a Rolls Royce, whatever it is. Even it's the most expensive vehicle, or cruise, or aeroplane, whatever it is, it will not run. And you need to c conduct regular maintenance. But when it's depleted, then you lose. You make, I mean, you, do not, you cannot run it. But you, you, are you a vehicle? <laughs> are you a human-made 
component, a vehicle or an airplane? Have you been fabricated? Are you a human robot? Come on. Are you relying on human fuels? What fuels? Were you in a womb of your mother? Did you depend on any human interference to keep you grow? Your cells to grow exponentially from one cell until 100 trillion cells, 70 to, uh, 50 to 70 trillion cells. But the baby is born, is made up of 50 to 70 trillion cells. The exponential growth of a cell, did, does it rely on the human made fuel? Let's think about it. What, what did it take place? What is inside the womb of the mother? What is inside the amniotic sac? Do not realize this. <laughs> this is you. You rely fully on body's essential fuels. And these fuels are not man-made. No human being can fabricate any of these fuels. No way. There is no science. There is no way. There is no technology. These fuels are created because you are created. You are not man-made. You are not a human mate. You are not a machine. So the moment when the baby is born, come up of the womb of the mother, the, the baby is crying and crying. You know why? Crying, asking for help, seeking, please, please. I came, I was formed in the womb of my mother through the created fuels, not the man made fuel. I need that, I need. So from there, from the moment the baby is born, need to continue those regulating the body with the fuel so that the body will maintain its own innate ability, perfect performance in all aspects. The physical, the emotional, the mental and spiritual. So simple. That's a logic, something to understand. And particularly water, oxygen, hydrogen, energy. Because the amniotic fluid is just what? It's hot water. It is aqua. Because it's composed, I mean, the amniotic fluid, 99% is water. 37.5 degree, degrees Celsius, uh, the temperature of the, the water. So it's hot, it's not cold, it's not warm, it's not uh, boil, it's not ice, it's hot. You, you know why? To supply, because they break up this oh, hot water, it break up to produce what? Water, oxygen, hydrogen, energy. And these, we have coined them the four essential elements of life, the feel, particularly, namely, as you could see here, as we call it, aqua or hot aqua, water, oxygen, hydrogen, energy, so simple. If you maintain that, believe me, you will no longer panicking. You will maintain yourself by yourself. Your body will have the inability, any virus, what do you call it? Coronavirus or you call it? any virus? Come on. Your body, your immune system, your ability to, make, to sustain any foreign invaders that enter your body, whether they're pathogens, microorganisms, uh, viruses, uh, harmful bacteria, uh, chemicals, and all these toxins, your body will fix itself by itself. Can, you, know, is, it, you are made to, to, to fight these foreign invaders. And so that's the reason we don't believe a disease. It's a dysfunction. So you need to solve the issue of that, that disease or the, the dysfunction by finding the root cause. And the root cause of that is to solve, to refuel your body. Remember about the vehicle. So you are not a man-made. Eh? You're not fabricated. You are not. So for me, I say, nobody touch me. My body fixes itself by itself. I maintain this fuel through the aqua revitalize. And why I call it revitalize? Because we do not treat. There's nothing called treat disease. Disease does not exist to me. So I already erased something called disease. There's nothing called asthma, cancer, rumbago, whatever you call. It's a dysfunction, and I don't, I don't need to treat it. There's no cure, there's no treatment. I just need to revitalize. Because a vehicle, you need to maintain, to keep a maintenance. You can put a vehicle in a, it go, get out from the place where it's been fixed, a mechanic, you get out from there, brand new. Look. That's you. You just need your body to get revitalized. So simple. That's what we focus. That's what we highlight.
Thank you so much, beautiful world. Please, please, do not let this video sh st stand with you only. You have seen it, you have watched it. Share, subscribe, so be updated. Share to your loved one. They will say, they will tell you thank you. They will appreciate you because you have also contributed to past to others. Share to as many as you can. And request them to like, to uh, subscribe, and, and write also your testimonial. We keep on collecting a testimonial so that we prove to the world that something simple is should not be underestimated. This can change your life and change the life of many people. It's an amazing. It's a created product. It's not a man-made. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.